Glory be to Jesus. Good morning. This is Bishop James Hansen Saki of the Christ Church International. This is the day the Lord has made. You will rejoice and you will be glad in it according to the counsel and according to the will of Almighty God. The Bible says in Thessalonians, 2 Thessalonians chapter 3 and verse number 1 and 2, it says, Finally, brethren, pray for us that the word of the Lord will have a free course and be glorified even as it is with you verse 2 and that we should pray that will be delivered from unreasonable and wicked men because not all people have faith but the Lord is faithful who shall establish you and keep you from evil on this day I stand as God's servant and I pray over your life as you embark on your activities today that God would deliver you from unreasonable and wicked men. It means that deliverance from unreasonable and wicked men is an act of God. It must be supernatural for the Apostle Paul to say that we have to pray. He said, pray for us that we will be delivered from unreasonable and wicked people. It tells us that they are wicked people and they are unreasonable people. People who just murder people just for properties. People who kill people just to take something away from them because of position, because of title, because of office, because of wealth, because of things that we would die and leave behind. You have people who are not reasoning very well, so they kill over these things. These people belong to the category described as unreasonable people, are people who are just jealous of people and are ready to destroy, slander, malign and castigate and destroy people's reputation for nothing. People's heart and reputation are just dragged down the mud by false accusation. These people belong to the category of unreasonable and wicked people. And the Bible says we should pray that we are delivered from unreasonable and wicked people because such people terminate your assignment. They are assassins of vision and they destroy people's future and careers. I pray in the name of Jesus that the Lord deliver you and your loved ones from unreasonable and wicked people. The Lord deliver you from unreasonable and wicked people in your workplace. Unreasonable and wicked people in your business. Unreasonable and wicked staff members that you have hired to work for you. May the Lord deliver you from unreasonable and wicked family members. In the name of the Lord Jesus, for all people don't have faith. May the Lord deliver you from wicked and unreasonable young men who are happy to stab and to murder for fun in the name of Jesus, those that are moved by demonic powers and witchcraft projections to kill for ritual purposes. The Lord deliver you from unreasonable and wicked people. The Lord deliver you from unreasonable and wicked husbands and wicked wives and wicked children. In the name of Jesus, wicked brothers and sisters, wicked uncles and aunties, the Lord deliver you in Jesus' name and the Lord be watchful over you and establish you, verse 3, and keep you from all forms of evil. I declare over your life in the name of Jesus that may you come under divine security in the blood of Jesus. I declare over your life that you will finish very well in your day and in your life. I declare in Jesus' most excellent and holy name that you will not fail and you will not die before your time. I pray over your life that everyone wishing you ill, all kinds of ill wishes, all kinds of satanic curses, demonic predictions and lamentations be abolished in the blood of Jesus. I pray that they all backfire. I pray that your soul escape like a bird out of the snare of the fowler. I pray in the name of Jesus Christ that Jehovah remember you and cause you to finish well. May God establish you that your feet will not be moved. Your foot will not be moved. Your business will be established. Your ministry will be established. Your family will be established. Your children will be established. Your investments will be established. You will not labor in vain. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I pray that God will be favorable to you and cause all things to work together for your good. In Jesus' most excellent and holy name. And until I come your way again, this is Bishop James Sansensaki of the Christ Church International. God is on your side. Go out and prosper. You will come back with victory. In Jesus' name. Have a blessed, fruitful, powerful, and productive day. God bless you. Bye-bye.